News that we've been following on the ground and in the air as well. We have just learned that one person has been killed in this massive fire in New Bedford. It appears that this was a boarding house. Now, we're still working to find out if other people were in fact hurt. Tammy Mutasa just arrived at the scene and she joins us now with the latest. Tammy? Lisa and David, you know, it is just such a devastating and tragic scene out here in the heart of New Bedford. Officials are telling us that one person has died in this devastating fire, and witnesses tell me that several people were rushed to the hospital in ambulances. And I'm going to step out the way and show you right behind me. You can see just how massive this response is right now. This yellow tape stretching for blocks as firefighters still trying to battle that fire that is raging in this massive four story building. Now, witnesses say thick smoke and bright orange flames started shooting out of the building around 3:30 here on a Kushnet Avenue witnesses gave us this dramatic cell phone video showing a man and a dog being rescued with a ladder from the top floor while that fire was still raging we're told again that several ambulances rushed from the scene with several victims and the mayor's office again confirming that one person yeah, that has yeah. tragically oh, died special. now the Department of Fire Services has deployed a rehab unit to help fire Firefighters here at the scene, and a hazmat team is also here to keep a close eye on the air quality for the community and first responders who are working really hard right now. Take a listen to what witnesses say they saw. When I first got here, it wasn't nearly as bad. It was like just starting off. I live right down the street, so um, to see like the whole roof cave in and like a historic building is kind of you know devastating here, uh, especially in this part of the city. You know. And back out here live again, you're looking at this massive response to this four story fire. Right now, police are saying traffic is being restricted around this area at Akushnet Avenue and Tolman Street as firefighters deal with this fire. They're asking people to please avoid this area. But again, for now, we do know that one person has died and several people have been taken to the hospital. We're going to stay here and stay on top of this fire as more of this information develops. For now, live in New Bedford, Tammy Mutasa, WBZ News. All right, Tammy, thank you.